Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. And back in the Ichirima, this is, this is, this is your call. If you continue with the dictatorship tendencies, if you continue showing that, you know, you are too powerful, you are powerful, you are powerful, it irks people, it irritates people. People become indignant. They become indignant. They, they, they don't want you. They don't want you. It irritates people. It puts off people. Pride puts off people. A humble person attracts people. A humble person attracts people. So Vaaka in the Ichirema, me I'm, I'm, I'm appealing to you and I say this from a very genuine point of view, from a good place, from a good place, that take a humbler position. And this is one of the things that I spoke about even when I tried to gravitate towards you, you know. I said, instead of us talking about PF going for Edgar Lungu, why don't we take a humbler position? This is this is one of my advices when I when when I tried to go with the UPND. Why the UPND did not want me? Because for them, they wanted me to start going for Edgar Lungu, eh, talking about PF, talking about the violence of PF. I said no. This is this is not the way we should go. We should take a humbler approach. I actually advise that let Haka in the come out and apologize for the failures in terms of promises and then relaunch re, re himself, relaunch re his new vision, his new direction. That's what I say. That's what I advise in case you want to know. I advise you PND that let President Haka in the Ichirema, you know, apologize for his failures, okay, for the way things are. To say, no, look, I thought this would be like this, this would be like this. this, is what I thought. But unfortunately, the circumstances are this. And therefore, this is the way we are going to go from now onwards. And, and I'm telling you, we would have pulled it off. We would have pulled it off. But no, 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 no. These uh, political uh, amateurs, UPND, political cantankers, UPND, they thought, no, 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 no. Let's start bringing, a, you know, the bloodshed of PF. Let's start showing people how P PF was whatever, whatever. Let's start talking about whatever. And this is the route now that Waka in the HLM is taking. He's taking now this route of, you know, no, let's see, uh, label them to be corrupt. Eh? Let's label them to be corrupt. Let's go for them. Waka in the HLM wants to go that route. He yeah, acquired no, Eddie Galungu is very bad. Hey, PF is very bad. Hey, they store money and whatever, whatever. It's too late. Too late. That route is too late now. It's too late. Even these cases that you are starting, it's too late. They will not bring you votes in 2026. They will not. It's too late to go into, uh, you know, uh, uh, prosecuting these people, painting them black, it's too late. The best that I'm, that I'm giving you, the advice that I'm giving you, is that take a humbler approach. Take a more engaging approach. Take a more listening approach. A more tolerating approach. A more forgiving approach. Calm down that horse. And start showing humility. It might save you uh, uh, some, something out of what is remaining. Otherwise, so far, Edgar Lungu is in a very good position. Very good position. And the, the, the disillusionment that you praise singers, Nava Max Muwenu, 
wa UPND consultant wa Max Muwe ni UPND consultant eh eh na wale mbaba litani eh who should learn from who eh eh mi allowance eh free education eh employment of whatever whatever that attitude that attitude we will not help you by UPND wa Max Muwe wa wa consultant wa wa consultant Max Muwe you should first consult me <laughs> before you start you know uh, talking about things here and there you should first consult you guys are not doing well you guys are disillusioned you are disillusioned you are drunk you are confused i mean accept things for what they are this is a reality it's a reality what happened yesterday it happened it is not in the figment of your minds uh -uh, or in the figments of our minds it actually happened. Edgar Lungu did land at in Kitwe on that uh, ground. And the people were excited. It was eccentric. It was eccentric when Edgar Lungu uh, walked in. I mean, it, people went into a frenzy when Edgar Lungu stood up to speak. It was pandemonium. You can check for about two minutes. People are just shouting. So happy to see Edgar Lungu. He didn't even need to say anything. He didn't even need to say anything. He didn't even need to say anything. He didn't need even to say anything. There, Edgar Lungu could have even stood up and said anything rubbish. People would have been crapping. Brenda Banks at Linda Linda Banks Ala I'm a politics yeah you are very funny yeah you are very funny I'm a politics democracy democracy for that one panty we have a lot of people make this mistake that when you go to school and you do political science or you are a lecturer of political science and you think you can order or do politics you know scientifically kwa ti ulimulabu wabula nani kani a test tube wavika mo sulfuric acid wavika mo menshi e fiambo kubila e wavika mo sha therefore if you omba i'm telling you this is my experience politics is has got a spirit that you, it's beyond reason sometimes it is beyond reason so you are first of all you are disputing the fact that no hey hey, hey they were kids hey, hey, they were no people what i'm telling you what has gone out in the country is the frenzy the excitement that people expressed when edgar lungu came in that is what has gone out. And that is a reality you, you need to deal with. You can refuse it, but if you are refusing it, you are just digging your own grave. You are just digging your own grave. That is a reality, a reality that has gone throughout the country and beyond, by the way, and beyond. People are, have, have seen those pictures and they are saying, hey, Edgar Lungu is popular. People are uh, psychologically you know getting attuned to seeing edgar Lungu said this is the man that is what you know those relations you know that uh, a, a, a eccentric a environment that is what it does to politics whoever is sitting there whoever didn't go there seeing those pictures in their mind they see to say hey so this is the man that is how mob psychology wins politics. That is why, that is how mob psychology puts people in state house. I mean, you get to wonder, you know those uh, cadres, when they go there, they, they are shouting, yeah, 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 they are shouting. And you look at them, these are guys who doesn't understand anything. But when they are passing in those streets at night, they are making noise. And you are sleeping in your comfortable beds. 
you start thinking, oh, so this is the guy that is popular. And yet this guy has just hired a few people to go shouting in the compound. But those who are inside in their houses, they start tilting their minds. They start tilting their minds. So that one by UPND, number one, <laughs> you, you need to accept the reality of it, that it happened. It happened and all the leaders, all the leaders of UCA were accepted yesterday. It, it didn't matter what you said. It didn't matter what nonsense you said. As long as you are speaking, you know, on the side of Ed Galungu, that's it. As long as you are speaking on the side of Ed Galungu, that's it. It's okay. I mean, let's face it. Me and Temple and the Fishing. Some of the leaders, we are resurrecting leaders who are supposed to be, you know, sleeping. Eh? We are resurrecting leaders who are supposed to be sleeping in peace politically. But because of what is currently going, what is currently going on, I mean, people are excited. They, are, they would rather have these <laughs> political, uh, political, uh, 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 what do you call, political ghosts come to life than to have Baka in Nigeria. And you are killing yourself by denying what happened. You are denying it. It happened when it happened. Go back and see those videos. Go back. Ed Kalungu didn't need to say anything. Because now some of you are saying, ah, but what are they saying? Hey, what is their message? What is the alternative? When Sata was winning uh, elections, do you think, go back and listen to Sata. Do you really think Sata was saying uh, many things? Sata was mostly joking. Mostly joking, talking about a ma he was not even making sense to a reasonable person. And a lot of people that have won power when when people when people rally behind you, they don't care what you say. They just don't care. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.